let's talk about some very hard nutritional facts. Uh, there have, have been recently a, a large number of studies on the actual dietary content of our food today. Um, this one study actually compared the, the content of nutrients, especially magnesium, in the food, food basket uh, at the turn of the last century, so at around 1900, uh, from daily food alone, North Americans were able to get about 500 milligrams of magnesium per day. And if we investigate the average food basket today, products bought at Loblaws or, or other uh, grocery stores, we barely get 200 milligrams uh, from diet alone. And that's obviously not enough. Another study from uh, the National Academy of Science uh, um, published in 1989 uh, concluded that 80% of the North American population at that time are or were magnesium deficient. And that's 31 years ago. Since then, we have harvested from our fields and soils 30 more years, 31 more years, and each harvest takes out minerals and with that, the actual mineral content in the crops that we harvest goes further down. So I would estimate that today's uh, status would be more leaning towards the 90% of the population. Um, so why do we end up nutrient depleting? As discussed, mineral depletion of the soils is huge. I mean, when you think about it, we, we get our average oranges from plantations in Florida. We get all kinds of crops from plantations in um, Mexico or across the world and also from Canadian soils. And minerals are elements. They cannot be grown or regrown in the soil. They are in there and there every harvest takes out certain quantities. Rain is distilled water practically. It doesn't br bring back anything. And as long as farmers are not replenishing the soils with key nutrients like magnesium, zinc, selenium, and all the trace elements, then these soils over the years get more and more mineral depleted. Processed foods that we consume are even further nutrient empty due to the process that they go through. And furthermore, processed foods contain preservatives, coloring, and all kinds of other additives that we practically need to metabolize in order to detox them. And these meta metabolic steps require cofactors and uh, nutrients like minerals to activate enzymes. So these additives practically steal our uh, nutrient supplies. Prescription drugs that we take on a daily basis do the same. And here's a list of um, prescriptions that specifically uh, deplete the system of um, of magnesium. Uh, one that I actually didn't have in here is metformin, which is a um, blood sugar regulating medication that also depletes magnesium. And we're going to be talking about diabetes in just a few minutes. Um, so if you have to use any of these medications on a regular basis, it would be wise to uh, replenish your system or maintain at least your system with a, a good, good uh, supply of magnesium and other trace minerals. 